We're in the Air Comfort Solutions kitchen, and in today's cooking corner, our friend Heather Berryhill is making jalapeno bacon bites that are keto friendly. Hi, Heather Berryhill here. Welcome back to my home kitchen. Okay, it's March Madness. You're hosting a watch party, and you want to serve an appetizer, but you also may be trying to stick to a keto friendly diet. Well, I've got you. I've got some keto friendly jalapeno bites that are super delicious. So let me show you how to make them. So I've lined my cookie sheet with some parchment paper just so it doesn't stick and the cleanup will be easy. Next, I'm going to go ahead and cut the smoked sausage. You can use kielbasa for this also, just into some little disc. Now I'm going to cut the bacon in half to make half pieces. Now I'm going to take one disc and put it towards the bottom of the bacon and then just wrap all the way around. So you see that the bacon is kind of at the edge there because you're wanting to make a little bacon sausage cups. Then you just want to secure that with a toothpick and have it go all the way through. Then you're going to take your cups and just line them on your parchment lined cookie sheet. And you want to kind of space them far enough out so that they have room to cook all the way around. So I've got my little cups ready to go. I'm going to start with mincing one large shallot. Okay, I've got a block of habanero cheddar cheese here. You can use jalapeno cheddar cheese if you want. I'm going to go ahead and grate this entire block. This is one eight ounce package of shredded habanero cheese. I'm going to add it to my minced shallots. I've got one large jalapeno here. I'm just going to cut off the stem, slice it down the middle, and get all of the seeds and the veins out. Now I'm going to mince that jalapeno up really, really fine. Now we're going to take those jalapenos and add them to the bowl. Only thing left to do is put one block of softened cream cheese into the bowl. So I took a blender and kind of got it started because you'll give your arm a workout if you don't. But I'm going to finish it with the spatula and just kind of making sure everything is blended together. You can use two spoons to fill the cups, but I think it's just as easy to use your fingers. I've got my little jalapeno bacon bites all stuffed with that cheese. Now I'm just going to sprinkle over a little bit of smoked paprika before they go into the oven. So the great thing about these is you can put them in an air fryer on 390 degrees for about 15 minutes. But today I'm going to put them in a 400 degree oven for about 20. I pulled our keto friendly jalapeno bites out of the oven and I just let them cool slightly and I'm going to start stacking them on my platter. I even like to leave these crunchy edges on here of just the cheese. That is the best part. They're not the prettiest appetizer, but I promise you, your guests will go wild over these. So there you have it. Keto friendly jalapeno bites for your next watch party. For more recipes like this, go to the research.com website or follow me on Instagram at just me, Heather B. And you can also check out many more recipes like this one going to our website, newson6.com slash recipe.